How's it going Panthers? My name is Alfonso and today we're going to be showing you a little tour throughout the school. You know, hallways, offices, everything you need to know from when you freshmen, sophomores, juniors, just in case you know you get lost because I mean even me myself I got lost in freshman so you still need it. Alright, let's get going. Hello, how's it going? How Attendance, uh, registration, and vice principal. And over there is a clock. Very nice looking <laughs> clock. So over here is <clears throat> our beautiful li Bruh. library. <laughs> but it's closed, so we can't go in. But let's just imagine, like, you guys know what a library looks like. Oh, this area over here. <clears throat> Yeah. So yeah, in 2018, the official thing was open to the whole school. It's pretty nice. We're going to show you guys in just a bit how, how it works. It's actually pretty, pretty good. It's like a really nice cafeteria. Just guys, when you're in there, just please don't screw it up because it's a really nice cafeteria. Like, if it's if it's new and it's clean, just keep it like that way, okay? So this is just our beautiful semi cafeteria. Pretty nice, right? There's the, oh, sorry, restrooms. Girls' restroom and guys' restroom. These are the much older restrooms. I mean, usually I recommend going to the much newer ones, but there is time for, I don't know why, like security just decides to close down the bathrooms. And, but either way, I mean, you could use whatever restroom. I mean, it's you guys' choice. So this is the 300 hallway. Of course, it's still under construction. This, these restrooms right here are uh, just for the teachers. These are, I mean, I know this, so they, they look so new, so good. But well, that's just the bonus. We don't really know how it's going. Either. It's just for teachers. That, you can drink water, a little fountain. Again, these are the same restrooms, but those are for the cafeteria ladies. Uh, this is just another part, extra part of the school. They're still under construction. We still don't know what they're doing, but they are going to add up more stuff years later. As you can see down here, all of these are uh, plaques. They're just, they're, they're set there for each year, you know, when students, students graduate. It started from, I get what is it, 1955, right? 1955, all the way to, all the way to 2019. Except that we still need the 2020 and 2021. For some reason, they forgot about it, which is sad. Okay, so, this, this over here is the 400 hallway, and I believe this is what we're talking about for All right, guys. So this is the 400 hallway. Some of these classrooms are actually like one whole classroom together. They just have two separate doors. I have no clue why they would do that. But they, they did set up hand sanitizer. That's the garbage can. Another water fountain. I usually have a drink from the other one. But I mean, it's still the same thing. Uh, we're in here. You can hang out with your friends. You can sit right here. You can uh, hang out over there. So this is the girls' restroom. Yeah, this is the Jack's restroom. The boys' restroom. These are the ones I actually like. These are like the much newer, cleaner ones. Our beautiful garden over here. There's not much right now because once again, the students haven't been here to really maintain it or you know anything. So it's just really empty right now. I mean, there is a couple of flowers here over here. Too. Oh, cool these classes are all so they're just classrooms, like So for you students, we're gonna have, most likely these are gonna be like car or anime. Those types of classrooms. Just look right here, guys. If you're lost, just look at the thing. 800. So this is the 900 hallway. Uh, these hallways are only, I mean, they're they're new. Aren't they? Yeah, they're kind of new. It's always 900. It's a pretty good place to chill. It's pretty mostly cool in here, like so. But when it's cold outside and you're in here, you're gonna be freezing. I don't think we have heaters, but I don't think we have heaters in here. 
But yeah, you guys, you know, if you guys, if you only get lost, just classroom 903 or classroom 906. I mean, there will be link leaders that will help you guys along the way in case you, you're you just not too sure. But you guys can always ask a link leader. 905, and I mean, sometimes they just, the teachers leave like little thank you notes or they decorate their doors. Right now, they obviously, they haven't been decorated. No doors or nothing because there's no students, there's no way to maintain the school spirit. It's like empty. So, of course, you guys will revive all of it. So, if you go this way, over here, it's uh, portable. It's just like extra set of classrooms because you know the school is so freaking big. There's so many students, and obviously we need those extra classrooms, you know, for anything. Oh, look, is that Dutch Tone class? Yes. Okay, but this again, once again, is the garden area. You guys can always go through that gate. Seven hundred once again. It's still under construction, but I'm still gonna show you guys what they're making. Like right now, they're remodeling most of the classrooms over here. It's actually the the gym, like the no, not the gym, the workout room. Yeah, the workout room. So right there, you could you know lift weights for those dudes that are trying to really get you know buff like me. Oh uh, yeah, so you could go in there, you could work out, sweat a lot. Uh, you know the whole routine, you know, just lift weights, try to impress the ladies. There is still under construction, so they need to park their vehicles somewhere too. But this whole thing, this thing, this thing, really, you can hang out during lunch. It's just I'm not sure if most of the time uh, the security is going to get you guys. Because when we were here, and sometimes we were like over there by the fountain, and sometimes security would come and say, hey, you guys can't be right here, so you guys gotta go all the way to the front. I'm like, okay, then, so we'll go all the way to the front. I know it sucks because there's times where you just have that favorite spot to hang out with your friends. I had to, like, man, I just want to be right there. But they just don't let me. Come on, we're not doing nothing. So over here is more affordable. Uh, five, four, uh, three. Over here is the, uh, uh, what is it, the softball? It's baseball? Yeah. Baseball, yeah. This is the baseball area. So those are the series of the there's the, the workout room right here. I don't really use this area that much, but it's for like baseball stuff. I don't, they don't really use this as much. I don't know if they are going to use it by the time you guys are here. Well, when we were here, they didn't really use it all that. I have no clue what numbers you guys are going to be, so you guys, but just please don't stress out your teachers or what number you are or something. If they say you're 28, please don't ask them what the 28 is. Just look down, 27, 28. Simple as that. Over here, this little, this door right here, right there, that's where the wrestling room is, so we're about to show you guys right now. So right here, it's the wrestling room. And this also, at first, they were actually going to, they were going to add books in there, but, you know, uh, when the whole school went to hell, you know, when the whole school just went down because of COVID, yeah, we couldn't take boxing anymore, so they closed it, um, there was no more wrestling, no more sports for the whole 2020, but 2021, now it's reopening, and we're getting there, guys, but you guys, I mean, you guys may still have a chance. Over here, this is another door that goes into one of the offices for, uh, for uh, the PE teachers. Yeah, for the PE teachers. Now, there's really not much in there. There's just like old photos and stuff they keep in there, but I think that's like an old office. Over here, this is actually the whole uh, men's locker room. So, yeah, I mean, when you guys are looking for the men's, like, where's the men's locker room? It's going to be right here, guys. Why is the men's locker room? Now, the, for the girls, this is the girls' because look, I mean, they're the, well, it doesn't say, but this is the girls' locker room. Like, I know this is the locker room. I'm not a sim. I know this is the lo girls' locker room. Right here, it's the special area for the bikes. So if you don't have a car, because you're still young, or you haven't got your driver's license yet, but you still come and bike, which is respectable, it's good, you're working out. 
This is where you can park your bikes. And you can use this little, uh, little uh, wire things that they used to tie up the bikes for. As you can see, they're very freaking dirty because they haven't been used in more than a year. Or you can use these right here. If you have your own chain, your own lock, then you can lock it there. I mean, nobody's really going to steal it because, I mean, who the heck's going to want to just steal a bike in the school? Unless, of course, then you're a thief and you really want to steal it, but you're going to end up getting caught because there's cameras. So, you can have the parking area for the bike. So, over here is the, what's going to be the pool area. So, when your PE teacher says, so, um, we're gonna go swim to the pool. So you guys could sometimes go from this way or you guys, even from the locker rooms, there's like a back door where you guys could take and it just takes you right away to the um, small gym. To the, to, the, to the small, or the small gym. Yeah, so this actually, this takes you to the small gym as well. It takes you to the pool or the small gym. But to be honest guys, I like the big gym way better. I mean, the small gym is much older. It does have this little weird smell to it. Let's just say it's not a very good pleasant smell. But that's only when they're cleaning the gym because it's like really old. I mean guys, this school's really old. It's been here since like what? The 40s or like the 50s? I don't know, but yeah. So, these are the 1100 uh, classrooms. All of, all of this from MIDI attack. MIDI attack, yeah, the MIDI. So this whole thing, well actually this is probably the MIDI attack. The rest are like algebra and Whatever they have for fun. I don't really know. I'll each every single classroom, guys. So, I mean, don't be so hard on me. Because they do eventually, teachers do eventually end up switching classrooms. Or sometimes they switch up on content. Like, sometimes one teacher will like, do algebra, or then they change and then probably do like art. That could always happen. You know, anything's possible. Here is the uh, 1100. Oh, okay. Let's just leave this open. I'm not sure. Bruh. And it's large. But this is the 1100. See the number right here, the 1100 uh, building and handicap as well. All of this, 1100 classrooms. 1100 uh, classrooms. Uh, this is another area where you guys could like hang out during lunch time. It's all right to hang out here. But there's once again, there's gonna be times where they're gonna ask you guys to go the front. I don't know why. I mean, they just feel like it's like they don't want people to be. Uh, you know, messing around or flying. I, I don't know, but it's, you know, different versions. Hey, man. How's it going? Hey. Good, good, right? <laughs> so, this is actually the art classroom, and that's actually my teacher. <laughs> Which I still need to fix my game. <laughs> so, uh, this is, uh, oh, well, that's just another teacher. That's the 1100. So right here, this is uh, like the visual exit area for like the tennis. It's also the entrance. So this is the whole thing here. It's a very nice area. You have to run, jump to play tennis. And there's a tennis court. <laughs> so right here, this area is this where you will also come to the wood shop classroom. So it's just another way. There's two ways. There's the door from the other side that has the little wood shop sign. Or oh, there's this way right here. And yeah. um, this is another area where me and my friends used to hang out, but it's just stuff over there. It doesn't really matter. There's also a nut, like a parking lot, so, so, oh, so over here, it's just another exit for your parts. I think this is mostly for the teachers, guys, because, I mean, you know, teachers need it a little more closer. And more but if you have a car, you can actually park right here. Yeah, I don't really think they get full cool unless it's like an event or something going on. Or unless all the students in the school have a course. And if it's funny, then I guess you can park like right here too. Just make sure to be careful, you know, not to hit like no other course because then you don't want to get in trouble with the teachers or with the students. Well, that's just another way to actually, you know, in case you park a little bit. This goes for teachers or anyone. So, that was the whole idea of the high school, guys. If you guys got any questions or concerns about the school, make sure to go to your nearest link crew leader or even a teacher and they may help you, you know, guide you wherever you have to go. But you guys will get, eventually you'll get used to the whole school, you know, the whole map, the whole geography. You'll get used to it over the years, guys. But as your fresh, as freshmen, uh, it does get really hard once again. 
But just make sure, guys, you know, to enjoy your school years because they fly really fast, guys. Like, I'm not kidding, they really do. You know, enjoy your school years. You know, just don't be trying to you know, feel like those people were, you know, messing around with some other dude just because for the fun of it. Like, don't be bullying, guys. Just, just try, you know, instead of just making up en enemies and trying to get yourself into more trouble for no exactly, no, for no reason. Just to make yourself look tough, guys, it's not gonna make you look tough. It's gonna make you look like a complete freaking weak. I'm not gonna cuss because this is for a video. But it's just gonna make you look weak as heck. You're gonna get your, your butt whooped. It's not gonna be good. So, guys, be nice. Have a nice one. And this is the last video you guys ever see from me. This is Afonso Baez in 2021. And my, ca my cameraman, Mikey. Mikey Miguel. We hope you guys have a very good uh, school year. We hope you guys make the best out of the school years. Because I understand nobody really wants to be in school, guys. I mean, we just want to head off to work. But no, first you got to get out of school and then to work or college. Anyways, guys, have a nice one. Goodbye. Adios.